has seen a vast change in the 21st century. Decades back, it looked like this. Today, it looks like this. And a few years later, it will be like this. In a country like India, where agriculture and its allied sectors still provide the largest source of livelihood, adopting new farm policies and irrigation techniques is of utmost importance. Understanding the need of our farmers, the government of Odisha has always encouraged innovative methods to increase agricultural productivity and enhance their quality of life. One such successful initiative has been the Parbhuti Giri Mega Lift Irrigation Project undertaken by the Department of Water Resources. Despite having an abundance of water, the state's difficult terrain had hindered the growth of agricultural production. However, since the introduction of the Lift Irrigation Scheme in 2011-12, the benefits have been manifold. आमे बहुत सुविधा रे इखनगा अछु हमर कलिंगला मेगा इरिगेशन प्रोजेक्ट हेबा फल रे हमर एठरो चासी मानकर एत्ते आनंद उल्लास रे से माने चासवास करचोंती आ जहा के हमर जमी रे सोना फल अलिया फार्मर्स रिलाइड ऑन रेनफॉल और फ्लो इरिगेशन बट लिफ्ट इरिगेशन नाउ प्रोवाइड्स वाटर टू अपलैंड एरियाज बाय लिफ्टिंग वाटर फ्रॉम रिवर्स और रिजर्वर्स it is an alternate method to supplement Karif irrigation, where conventional flow irrigation isn't possible. The project is controlled by an AI system, Supervisory Control and Data Acquisition System or SCADA, which allows real-time monitoring of synchronized flow, power consumption, alarms, etc. Each lift irrigation scheme covers an area varying from 500 to 2000 hectares. In this venture, 208 mega lift schemes grouped into 17 clusters have been grounded since 2013 with successful completion of almost all schemes covering an Ayakut area of 2,64,330 hectares. Each mega lift scheme includes lifting of surplus surface flow of the river or reservoir through heavy duty high head pumps. The flow is then utilized for irrigation purposes through an underground distribution network by a pressure networking system, which is micro-irrigation capable up to one hectare sub-chuck level. Each scheme has also been provided with a dedicated power source from the local grid substation to ensure uninterrupted quality power supply. <laughs> These smiles vouch for the success of the mega lift irrigation project, which has benefited around 7 lakh upland farmers. The short duration construction period, absence of land acquisition or displacement and high efficiency of the irrigation mechanism are just some of the reasons why the project is being widely praised. Since its implementation, Odisha's irrigation efficiency has increased substantially to 80%. Upland farmers now have the option of cultivating cash crops, fetching them higher returns and keeping them consistently employed. As a result, the state's crop production has seen a significant rise. Environmentally too, the optimum use of water resources on more farmlands has given a rise to flora and fauna to flourish in the 23 districts where the schemes have been implemented. <laughs> Acknowledging the success in the first phase of the Mega Lift project, commonly known as Mega Project among the farmers, 
170 new schemes have now been identified in other upland areas. These will be taken up in a phased manner in the next five years, from financial year 2021-22 to financial year 2025-26, with the creation of additional irrigation potential of nearly 2,63,800 hectares. Odisha's Water Resources Department has also implemented several training and educational programs for farmers to not just enhance agricultural development but also their livelihood. Farmers are the backbone of our society. Their success or struggles reflect on our daily lives. Just as every drop of water counts, we believe that every farmer's livelihood matters and we vow to support them in any way we can. <laughs>